Hey guys, Doug here again. A little bit of a different video, but uh, as I mentioned earlier, we are going to dive into a uh, little series of beginning to wood carve. And uh, in the series, I want to take you from wood selection to tools to safety, sharpening, inspiration, just the whole gamut, kind of to get you from where I started to where I am now, and just kind of try and give you all the information. Reason being is that. Uh, of all the things on this channel, from canoeing and hiking and bushcraft and crafts and everything, my email is still flooded on a daily basis with uh, questions. And uh, I don't mind answering them when I can, but sometimes it's just too much to handle. And, oh, probably two years ago, I did do an introduction to wood carving video. And it was all in, all inclusive, all in one video. And it was uh, too too short, too smushed together, and uh, if someone has a question about a knife or about the wood, I couldn't point them to that video because I'd have to say at minute 17 I talk about wood or whatever. So the series is going to be broken up into individual videos, and I can just say go back to the playlist of uh, Introduction to Wood Carving and you'll find your answer there. And uh, that's what I want to do, but in the meantime, since I made that earlier video, I've changed. I, I do things differently, and uh, I think that's just like the evolution of a uh, craft and hobby. That uh, hopefully you're not the same as you were two years ago. And uh, as I learn more, I implement more things and change things up. So I can only tell you what I what I know. But anyway, the point of this video is uh, just to kind of introduce myself and tell you my story and how I got started. Well, it's, uh, it's hard to say now because my timing is so far gone and the years slip by like weeks and every time I say something, uh, I say five years, my wife always corrects me that it was 14 years ago. So I'm going to say four years ago, I was just uh, looking for something to do and uh, scrolling through YouTube and came across a video from Gene Messer and it was called Carving a Compact Character. Now, I had never in all my years carved anything, and uh, I watched that video and I got really intrigued, and uh, from that, I carved what I, th I was proud as punch, a little fella like that, and this guy now does not even make the shelf behind me. But I thought that was great, and I'm telling you, I carved it with a knife. If this is a more 106, I think I carved it with an Adventure Sworn uh, Woodsman, which is a much bigger knife than even this. And uh, yeah, I thought I was just doing a fantastic job. So anyway, that was, uh, like I said, four, maybe five years ago, and uh, it took. See, I spent my whole life uh, building houses, and uh, I'm a trim carpenter by trade, and hundreds of houses we've built and worked on, and there was nothing that I had come across yet in my life, even uh, more than fishing, that gave me such a satisfaction of, even though he's ugly as sin, <laughs> nothing was more fun to me, because, uh, I don't know, it's just taking a piece of wood and not being part of a house or a railing or a banister to create something that you looked at and it made you smile. And as you know, if you've been following me, most of my little characters, if you look at them, they're, they're comical and they're fun. And that's what the, that's where we're headed, by the way. I should have mentioned that. I like to carve like uh, caricatures. So like this guy is my, my mascot. He, this is Woody. And, uh, you know, right down to, to little guys like this. And then even last night, I did uh, this fella, which I put magnets on the back. So anyway, like I said, all my stuff, I, I like, uh, don't want to be too serious about it. I don't want to, I, I'm not realistic. I don't do realism, but anyway, I'm getting off track. Uh, nothing had given me such satisfaction and kept my hands busy because in my life I am uh, kind of a freak. I have a very hard time winding down. If I uh, 
sit down before 10 o'clock at night from six in the morning that's a that's an early night because i just have to keep going and if i'm waiting i'm pacing i i just need to keep my hands busy and something about taking a knife and a little little block of wood just really resonated with me and uh yeah i'm uh, i was instantly hooked and uh found my new little hobby splash passion so that's where i'm coming from and uh from that point uh, the video started back in the day uh i started a youtube channel when i was part of a bushcraft forum and uh the reason being was we would do these challenges like either survival or, or friction fire or you know like uh, overnighters but when we were doing them we would videotape them so that we could post them on the forum this is way back in the day and uh, that's how I started into the YouTube but at once I got into carving like years later and a couple a couple YouTube channels later uh, got into the carving I thought all we're carving is spoons and there's nothing wrong with that but that was the the extent of the carving and I thought that uh, when I discovered my ugly little man here I thought this would be fun to do in a video and uh, it's it's all related nature trees wood bushcraft hiking camping and uh, I thought I'll go out and make a video and that was a, a silent video and this fella has spent a good four years outside and I just brought him in a while ago but this was my first video this was Sycamore Sam now even then that was my first video on wood carving and also my first silent video by the way but uh, I hardly knew what I was doing but I wanted to share with the bushcraft guys so that's what I did. I made this little guy and uh, that video went over. I acted like an idiot in it, but it's a, a fun video. But that video went over really well. And I thought, oh, there's something to this. And uh, I'm going to keep doing it. So that's how I kind of got into the carving video portion. Didn't know what I was doing. Didn't even know uh, that there was a whole community of wood carvers out there like I do now and uh, I just kept making videos for the bush crowd and then slowly other people have trickled in and uh, kind of like the uh, the carving videos and since then I have had so many people pick up uh, knives and start carving and I just think it's great and if it wasn't for someone like Gene Messer then I couldn't be doing it today either because I wouldn't even known so you don't know if you want to be a woodcarver until you see someone woodcarve. So that's uh, that's how I got going, and that's uh, Sycamore Sam. So we went from Ugly Man to Sycamore Sam, and now I'd like to think I've got a little bit better. Look, I'll show you this guy again. This is Norbert the Elf. Now there is a progression. <laughs> if you can see how terrible this guy is to this guy, right? And that's what I want to keep sharing. And this year, I have met my first woodcarvers. Just just in the last two months, I had never met another woodcarver other than uh, videos. So hopefully this uh, gives you a better idea of where I'm coming from. And my only goal is to uh, really create more carvers. Uh, I think by me sharing on YouTube and through trips and outings and whatnot, wherever I do some carving, that uh, we can pique some interest. Like like I said before, how are you going to know that you want to carve a, whatever, a silly Christmas tree with a happy face? You know, if you don't see it, you don't know that you want it. And that's just like, I wish that I had seen this 20 years ago because I'm sure it would have taken then. So it's fun to see new carvers popping up, new people to my channel. And uh, I'm going to keep on doing this. And this intro series is just the beginning we're going to keep on doing hopefully weekly bi-weekly carving videos as long as well as the uh, crafts and outings and whatnot but it's just i think I, I i have a little bit of a heart for the the younger generation that will be on youtube and that uh 
is stuck on their phone and their iPads and whatever and hopefully turn them on to a little bit of a wood carving and make some real good carvers out there like I said am I qualified to teach not at all I'm just a, a student like you and uh, probably shouldn't be teaching but uh, not many people are so I'm gonna keep on doing what I'm doing and uh, we'll grow this little community and yeah that's my that's my heart and that's where I'm coming from so that's why we're gonna do this video series they're gonna come out quicker than uh, the normal videos I want to do them every few days until the series is done and perhaps uh, make sure to be subscribed or have your notifications on because I think after the last video I would like to do maybe a one hour uh, live stream where you can ask me questions and uh, finish it up so that's about all I got to say and uh, I will catch you on the next video and uh, hopefully more after so thanks for watching and uh, See you soon. Bye-bye.